What's up everybody? Today we're going to be doing a tutorial on how to remove blemishes from skin. So, I woke up with this huge thing on my face, so I'm going to show you how to turn that into this. Alright, let's get into it. So recently I had a film shoot and we had the task of getting this shot done in a short amount of time. The actress that showed up, she had a breakout that day and we didn't have a makeup artist on set. I was able to touch it up just a little bit but you could still see a little bit of that breakout and she was so nervous about being on camera and I said the dreadful words. I said, I'll fix it in post. So I hate those words. Those should never come out of any director's mouth and they came out of mine that day because I had to. I didn't have time. There was no way around it. We didn't have a makeup artist. We didn't have nothing. So we're sitting there and she's so nervous about being on camera. I just said keep you know, motivating her and tell her, hey, everything's going to look great. Don't worry about it. And then I get back and I was able to turn this into this. Check out this before and after. So the way we're going to do this is I'm going to jump into the computer and show you guys exactly how I fixed this. Today's going to be a short video. What we're going to do is we're going to throw this horribly bad dad joke into the timeline and we are going to fix this right here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to stand right here and I'm going to tell a joke and we're going to put this on the timeline and we're going to edit it up and take this completely out. We're going to be opening up Adobe Premiere Pro. This this is going to be completely done in Adobe Premiere Pro. You don't have to take it into After Effects or do anything like that. So it's only going to be in Adobe so you don't have to be afraid of After Effects like a lot of people are. So this is going to be a simple little tutorial. We're going to jump into the computer right now and we're going to jump right into it and you'll be able to see as I go through this edit. I'm going to do a little quick so be sure to stop this video, pause it if you need to whenever you're making this yourself. Alright, so first thing, we're going to drag our clip to the timeline and we're going to watch it to make sure it works here. So what time of day was Adam created? Just a little before Eve. <laughs> what a bad dad joke, right? Alright. Alright, so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to go over to our effects control. We're going to click up here. We're going to type in Gaussian Blur. I don't know how to say it. Gaussian, Gaussian, something like that, but it's right here. You can just type that in and it'll be able to pop up. Yeah. So then we're going to drop it onto our clip. We're going to go up here and we're going to hit our effects controls. And we will jump right down here. And all right, so we'll go up here. We'll hit our mask. We're going to do the circle mask because it's a circle that's on my face. And that'll be the easiest that'll make it where it blends in with my face. So what we're going to do is we're going to adjust this to get it right over the area that is effective that we want to take out. Take the blur up. About 27 is what it takes for what I'm doing. So I'm a, you can just adjust it to see how bad or how light yours is just until it gets it where it's not there anymore. Now what we're going to do is we're going to hit tracking. So what tracking does is it's going to try to find that spot and keep it where when my face moves it stays with that location. So sometimes this doesn't work, and if that doesn't work, you can go do it by frame by frame, but sometimes the tracking key will be able to walk it all the way through there. And this is how you do this. You just go up here, and instead of hitting the play button, you just hit this little arrow to the side, and that'll take you through. But sometimes the tracking key will be able to walk it all the way through there. Let's see how it did. So what time of day was Adam created? Just a little before Eve. That looks pretty good. Let's do a side by side so you can kind of see with and without the spot. And so, what time of day was Adam created? Just a little before Eve. So, what time of day was Adam created? Just a little before Eve. Looks like it worked out really well. All right, cool. All right, back to past me, I guess. All right, see ya. All right, thank you for watching this episode. Uh, if you liked it, please hit that like button. Please subscribe to the channel. We got a lot more tutorials, a lot more stuff coming out like this to be able to help you grow in your career as we grow in ours. And hit that bell so that you're notified whenever I bring out a new video. We're going to be doing some pretty cool stuff next week. Thank you for tuning in and God bless. I'm sure people are going to be like, oh Andy, don't you know you're fearfully and wonderfully made? Don't worry about that zit. You don't have that thing on your face. It's it's so bad. Look, look at this thing. It's like, it's huge.